Welcome to MarcusG.TV. I'm Chef Marcus Giuliano. I'm a chef on a mission. Today's mission is uh, 50mistakes.com. It's my website on cyber coaching restaurants. So I was just asked the other day by somebody, and they said, Marcus, what's the best advice you give to somebody who wants to be a restaurateur or a brand new restaurateur? What's your best advice for them? And I said, man, there's no... We, we could spend a week going over the best things you should be doing as a new restaurant tour or even before you open your restaurant, things to be doing. Um, so, you know, here's, here's the one thing I want to really stress to somebody who's thinking about going into the restaurant industry or that just started, okay, it's brand new. It's hard to make money in this industry. It's very hard. A lot of people go in undercapitalized. They think that they're gonna make money from day one and start turning a profit. There's very few restaurants, very, 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 very few restaurants that can actually make money from day one. Okay, unless you have a lot of money just laying around. Now here's here's the, the standard industry joke. How do, you, uh, how do you end up with a small fortune in the restaurant industry? You start with a large fortune. That's the joke that we say to each other as restaurateurs. So, you know, here's, here's the, you have to understand that, that it's not an easy industry and it's not easy to make money. The margins are very small, very small. Um, one of the new things that I do for my brand new staff is I put 100 pennies on the bar and I say, tell me how many pennies Marcus and Jamie are going to put into their pocket for every dollar the customer gives us. And you'd be surprised. Your employees think that I'm putting like 40 cents, 30 cents, 25 cents in my pocket. Wrong. We're putting barely 5 cents in our pocket. That's why the proper, I mean, everything has to be so in sync in a restaurant. The amount of volume, your overhead, um, employee management, food cost management, uh, marketing, everything has to be in harmony to be able to make a profitable restaurant. And location does help. We always hear the term location, location, location. But the thing I'm trying to stress in this video is because go to my uh, website, 50mistakes.com, 50mistakes.com, and you'll see a bunch of uh, tips and techniques and tools to help you succeed in your restaurant. The thing I want to really stress in this video is it's hard to make money. Don't think because you have an idea or you're a chef with a passion that you're a good business person. And don't think because you're a business person that you can go in and and because you make any other business work that you can go start a restaurant and apply those other principles because a restaurant is such a different animal. It's such a different business really a different business. I'm not saying you can't do it and you can't make money. There's a lot of successful restaurateurs out there, highly successful restaurateurs out there. I've been open for 10 years. I think I consider myself successful. Um, there's a lot of people out there making some good money in this industry, but don't let those examples think that, well, I can do what they do, okay? You might be able to, but chances are, you know, they're an exception to the rule and the chains have everything figured out. You know, Outback, um, TGI Fridays, all those have it exactly figured out, an exact formula, a support system, um, large amounts of capital. Um, so, you know, us independent restaurateurs don't have all that. But if you get onto my website, 50mistakes.com, I can teach you how to get a support system. I can teach you how to train staff. I can teach you um, how to do food costs, how to manage reports, how to, how to run reports. All of that is so, so crucial. And the most important part, uh, is marketing. A lot of restaurateurs think they don't need to market because they're in a great location or because a lot of chefs think, oh, I have a great product and I don't need to spend money on advertising. Wrong. You do. It's five times easier, six, six times easier to get somebody back into your door, a repeat customer, than a new customer. And what's the easiest way to get a repeat customer in? You market to them. You do, do direct marketing. So um, Facebook, YouTube, uh, Twitter, uh, email blasts, these are all considered marketing. So if you're a restaurant and you're, and, you're, and you're not doing that, you're missing the boat. So log on to 50mistakes.com. Um, any other restaurateurs out there want to chime in, leave some comments on, uh, on what, uh, what, what your biggest tip to a new restaurateur would be? I'm Chef Marcus Giuliano. Thanks for watching.